What's going on my private counsel and Shemaine Man King Lister? How are y'all doing today? Anyway, before you even answer that question, because number one, it's a YouTube video so you can put it in the comments and after you pause the video. And number two, I forgot number two. Anyway, you saw the title, Little Nightmares 2. I've already recorded this twice. Once I had uh, a audio problem on the second time I had a audio problem so new microphone as you can tell because I sound like a damn angel from heaven next thing to come along on the channel would be a new chair possibly one with arms that doesn't creak and sound like it's killing my grandmother anyway resume oh no no damn it after making the mistake of clicking resume game, I forgot to make the, uh, the, the, the reduction of it. Wait, no. Doesn't matter. We're starting a new game because you haven't seen me play it yet. Let me see. It said I was in the school, which is about half hour in, which is about how long this video is. So, I'll just tell you everything that I said and everything that I didn't say. So I'm just going to be telling you everything. I'm probably not going to stop talking for a really long time, but then again I might, but who knows, eh? Anyway, during my first play through this, this beginning bit, how it starts to speed up as soon as you get close to the door in like three seconds, two seconds, one second, speed increase, wait, there was no speed increase, oh the TV was on. I hadn't noticed that. I played this twice. I did not notice that. Anyway, let's speed ahead. I already know most of the controls. You know, shift to sprint, space to jump, control to crouch, uh, left mouse button to grab onto things. Uh, I also discovered in the last episode, which you didn't see because there was an audio problem, that you can't sprint uh, whilst sneaking, which is slightly annoying, because like, you could do a crouch sprint, like pause the video right now, and like, tr try and do a crouch sprint, I mean, make sure you're in a padded area, because I don't want to be responsible for no deaths, but try it. Try it. Don't kill yourself, please. I like life. Life's fun. Life has chicken. Oh, bloody hell. Anyway, now that you've discovered that you can probably crouch sprint, uh. That's one problem that the devs didn't, that, that the, 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 the developers didn't uh, factor into the game. That can, that people can actually crouch sprint. Also, I discovered a bug last time I played this. It's when I got in the house. You, in fact, you'll see. I'll show you. I'll show you. Oh, I forgot about that three times. Two times. How many times have I played this bit? Played this bit what times? stupid audio problems but now 60 pound microphone keep forgetting you have to go up that log no it's not up that log it's up this log you know for saying that I've played this game I'm on my third instance of playing this part of the game and I'm still failing epically all the time However, I am going at... Oh my lord. However, I am going at a lot faster pace. Be right back, I'll be on the other side. Now, I'm back on my 300th attempt and I actually made it across. 
So, I'm going to wheel this down like the silly little handsome box head that I am. Because in the uh, last playthrough of this that I played, which you didn't see because of audio quality, I said that the main reason this character has a box slash bag on its head is because it looks like me. So beautiful that the, the mere sight of me not only brings joy to your whole life, but makes you blind from how beautiful I am. Forgot about that. You know, I only finished recording a 30 minute video of me playing this. Like, I played this 20 seconds ago. Well, feels like 20 seconds ago. But right before I started recording this video, I was recording the previous video, which was the exact same video, but with a, a different um, microphone. And uh, I've already forgotten all of it. So at least you're going to know authentic, pure fear in my eyes when you see it. You're going to love it too. because that's probably the type of people that you are. Sick, sick individuals that like to see fear in everybody's faces and hearts because you're all evil. And I am your slave. I bring you this grade A quality entertainment where I'm throwing pine cones around and almost dying despite the fact I've played this for the third time. Anyway, I do know that I'm awesome and that you're awesome too for clicking on this video. Thank you. Your, your view means a lot to me. And, you know all the uh, the big branded people, like uh, Mark Blyer, even my own fan, well not fan, but I'm a fan of them, MXR, he's decided to start doing uh, his own clothing company, I'm not going to do that, no, no, it's going to be up to you guys, oh shoot, I went the wrong way, it's going to be up to you guys whether I do that or not, because I am your YouTuber. Did the fans scream at Jacksepticeye to make his coffee? Probably. Anyway, what I forgot to say in that uh, bit was, here's Johnny. And as I've already said twice, because this is my third time recording this bit. I'm playing a game! <laughs> anyway, uh, in that movie, the girl, which was crying in the bathroom, was genuine fear. Because, yeah, I don't know why. She was scared. I think she got hit, like a lot, or abused, something like that. Anyway, I should probably get that message. Might be important. 
Yeah, it's a sponsorship from Coke. The Coke company. I'm, I'm going to reject them. No. I'm not one of those sellouts. You can't buy me for millions and millions of pounds. No. You know, I'm probably never going to take a sponsorship. This is always going to be pure. Uh, I think the word I'm thinking of is unadulterated me. Because I'm amazing. Who wouldn't want more me? You know, one fact that I did forget is in the previous game, this, this, this hoe that I'm working with freaking eats rats and stuff like that and she ate, she ate a mushroom I think but it was nice to her and helped her and she ate it fucking evil now come and help me because it helps you because she's the only person that she helps she's a magic evil coatless for some reason wizard and, and, and wizards are mean and this is where I found the um, the error because you see it fell through the arm you see and now I pick it up just straight out slide it out of the arm there's no injury marks on the arm Apart from the fact that it's completely torn off. Whoops. <laughs> but in my last playthrough, it just completely clipped through it. Is this a dead body? Oh, damn. And it was wet too. Minging. Oh, it's all goopy. Cool. But gross. We need to get her a coat and her magic powers back because she could complete this game in like 10 seconds if she wanted to. You're just like zibbity zabbity zoo. Oh, haven't you watched the first Little Nightmares? Because she was the Little Nightmare, literally, by the end. Because she got magic powers, she murdered all the fat people. You know, it was awesome. Oh, you should have seen me first time I freaking I went through this scene. I was shitting bricks. Multiple. And we've only got 15 minutes left. More specifically, 15.40. Now. At least that's all we should have. I died so many times on this bit. You ever heard of the derpiest player in the world at the game? Yeah, that's me. Evident from what just happened. Spring! Use those tiny legs. Yes, yeah, right. Burn. Yeah, you see, my kill count on this so far is one. I think. Whatever. But that's how many times I've died on this current playthrough because that's how many times he shot me. But on the previous one, 
when I had a bad mic, it was at least 20. I was baffled. This freaking hoe wants me to grab her hand. She's so freaking useless. What happened to her? She used to be magic. And now she's just gay. I mean, not it's wrong to be gay. Completely in support of female homosexuality. No, I, I support it with my eyes on uh, a specific hub that people know might know about. I support it with my hands a lot. But you don't need to know that. You don't need to know that, no. Too much information. However, male homosexuality. However, I do support that, but not with my hands or my eyes. No. Like, you're free to be it? Just keep it away from me, please. I don't like being exposed to such... such bad things. Especially at my young, young age. I wonder what we are to those large people. Bless you. I wonder if we're like rats or something because we steal from them, we take their food, we shoot them in the head. I can't remember the last time I got shot in the head by a rat though. Yeah. You know, there's probably like a little glitch that you could do. Like where you could let go just at the right time and she could die and it'd be so funny because I am 100% in support of death of freaking selfish people that only ever help themselves by helping others but me I always post videos for you I am your best friend I will never not post videos for you. Like, it might be another six months before I post my next video, but as I just said, I will never not post videos for you. I am that kind. People need their daily dose of me. Because without me, What's life even worth living? It's not. You need, you need your daily dose. Because I am the king. Your eyes love me. Okay. I didn't die like that on the last playthrough. You know, I actually kept my head underneath the water for quite some time. And it didn't kill me. And I was like, what? What is this? It was just completely unbelievable. Headphone wire tickling my nips. Can't be having that. The nips are a sacred zone. As it said on TikTok, for some of my younger fans, it's apparently my no no square. Oh, come on. I can hold my breath longer than that. But then again, they're tiny. So. 
tiny people have tiny breaths. Um, on the last game, there was tiny people in like a school, which was also like a jail, but also a school. And he fed you some bread. Well, he fed her some bread because she was selfish and starving and a girl and that kid in school was her tier 3 sub. He was a simp. And he was like, take my bread, take what I need to live. I don't see how he doesn't see that freaking box bobbing up and down in the water. So blind. Then I'm gonna, he does have a bag on his head. And one of those, uh, what's it called? Irish beanie things, an old person cap or something like that. Oh come on! Oh, I was there. That's mean. Anyway, kill counter. I think it's at three. Could be wrong. He's gonna lock. He's gonna lock. Seriously. Why is he not going to look? Oh, come on. What? I did this first try. Do I have to sneak? I probably have to sneak. Fucking run. Yeah, that's right. Hmm. Let's just hope that this freaking audio works for this one, eh? Because if it doesn't, I am going to go insane. Remember what I said earlier? Rats don't shoot you in the face. But me. I ain't no rat. I'm evolved. The thing is, uh, both of these characters, both female. This one seems male that I'm playing, but might not be. Which is sexist? Because it should be one male and one female. And we're at the three minute cutscene, or two and a half minutes, whatever. But that's going to take me down to three and a half minutes of gameplay once the door belt arrives. Maybe four minutes if you're lucky. And then we're going to have to say our goodbyes. Our tragic, tragic goodbyes. I mean, it's only for a short while, because part two is going to come out eventually. <laughs> I'm not going to give you any dates, because we all know exactly how productive I am. Which is not very. Also, let me know down in the comments below. I know there's not many of you, so I don't really have a wide enough average of people to vary the answer off as, but let me know if you would like me to stop speaking. <laughs> and you can't put permanently in, in the comments. I don't like stop speaking as much as I usually do because all I've done is ramble or something like that for 
half an hour ish about that anyway we're at the floppy city you know the flaccid city I'm going to be going into the school soon. The only reason I know it's a school is because uh, the um, the save that I had before with the bad audio quality, I got up to about here after I walked past the kid with the, the Tourette's. I mean, he didn't swear at me, but I still walked past him. There he is. I mean, he ain't got Tourette's now, but if I go near him, it, it is going to start shaking. I mean, maybe this game is being mean to people with Tourette's and it's like, say, don't go near him. But, I don't think that, you know. Someone's got Tourette's, it's just a disease. You know. So, so what about it? This dude got a three monitor setup. Nice. And it's got an internet cable, uh, monitor, monitor, monitor. Let's say uh, keyboard, mouse. Yeah, that's all you really need. Nice. Anyway, moving on. Going out of this wall, we are going into the territory of me not seeing anything previously that is so everything's new to me from here on this is a candy shop give me some candy give me them sweeties I like sweet oh it's not candy it's a bar I'm not a big fan on liquor but it's okay I'm closing the door. No, I'm closing the door. Get out of the way. Oh, it's spring loaded, I can't. Well, unless I can and she's just in the way. Oh. I thought there would have been a secret behind there, but apparently not. Oh. Anyway, on with the game. Hidden area. Oh, haven't run over yet. Any bad stuff? Oh, saving. That means I've got a minute and twenty ish to say goodbye to you. So, bye. I hope uh, you had a nice day. I hope uh, seeing me brought you happiness. You know, because I'm so beautiful. Why can't someone just be happy when they see me? Because I'm just that beautiful. The mere sight of me makes you cry with happiness. I'm like a reverse onion. That's so awesome. I like being a reverse onion. Anyway, have a good rest of your day. Bless you if you sneezed. You know, make sure to like the video, but only subscribe if you like. Those are my rules. And, uh, bye.